538. We are continuing our coverage of the nine firefighters as we remember those who were killed in the Sofa Superstore fire nearly a decade ago now. All week, News 2's Macy McLeod is featuring one of the firefighters each uh, half hour of our broadcast and how their family and their friends want them to be remembered. Today, Macy's talking to William or Billy Hutchinson's family, a captain on the department, and his second family, the employees at Williams Barbershop. Some of these people worked with Billy Hutchinson for more than 30 years. On days he wasn't at the fire station, he was at the barber shop. Everybody liked Billy, always smiling. Ten years later, Billy's station at the barber shop still bears his name. His coworkers tell me customers talk about him all the time. Yeah, we we mention Billy about every day in here, if not every day, every other. If we hear a thump, we'll say, "Well, that's Billy back there." They have a memorial where customers have contributed items to help Billy live on through the shop. They say along with that award-winning smile, he had an attitude that always lifted the people around him. He smiled when he came I've in the door. I've never seen Billy yeah. mad, did you? Mm -mm. Never no. once. Mm -mm. No. <laughs> he didn't get in all the gossip and stuff like a lot of people. And a personality that brought customers back for decades. When the store got the news Billy died in the fire, it affected everyone. Actually, it was the first time the shop had ever closed during business hours was for everyone to be able to attend Billy's funeral. The barbers say one thing is for sure. No matter how much time passes, Billy will not be forgotten. No, you never forget Billy. You never forget him. Macy McLeod, News 2. To watch all of the tributes to the firefighters that we've aired this week, you can head to our website, countonto.com. Be sure to tune in tomorrow for the rest of the series. Stay with us.